Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a new Dollar Tree review for you. These are nail polishes from LA Colors. They are glow and black light nail polishes. And we're going to talk about each individual polish and talk about them as a whole as well. First off, these are a dollar each. They had several different shades to choose from. I am a fan of LA Colors nail polishes. Whether they're thin, thick, take long to dry, quick dry, whatever it may be. I like all the fun collections they come out with. I even love the fact that each of their collections have different lids. Like these have a shiny black lid, non-textured. Here's a regular polish, textured non-shiny lid. This one has a colorful lid. Just for some examples, this one has a holographic glitter lid. And no, the glitter doesn't come off in your hands. The Mermaid Collection has this beautiful duo ombre kind of lid. So that is fun. LA Colors makes a lot of their products very fun and appealing to the eye, and I love that. Um, of course we know these are worth a dollar and me personally would repurchase any of the LA Colors polishes for a dollar. So that question's answered. But how well did they wear? How did they apply? How quickly did they dry? One of the most biggest ones is... So we have Radioactive Energy Luminous. First off to talk about Radioactive. Radioactive is a berry toned red and these polishes do have a wide brush which makes application very easy. Now Radioactive is a opaque in one coat when applied. I would apply two just you know because that's typically what I do, but it is opaque in one coat. It dries in minutes, so you're ready for your next coat. It's a nice thick formula for this one here, radioactive. In the clip, you'll see the glowing or not glowing. And when the black light gets close to it, it does kind of show a blue purple kind of hue to it, kind of like what you would expect. But to be honest, this is the least glowing nail polish of the lot. The other two are kind of fluorescent and bright, so you expect more out of them, versus this is a darker shade, that's why I picked it up, because I was so curious. I did put this on my toes, and it's been there for probably a week or more now, and it has not chipped. Also, Radioactive dries a glossy kind of finish, so you really, if you, I didn't even top coat my toenails. Um, because it is, dries very glossy. So that's nice to note about this one. So Radioactive, yeah, it barely, it, like it glows, but it's not great. Um, great opaque polish though, and dries glossy. Next up we have Energy, and this applies streaky first coat. Now, to achieve full opaqueness, I had to apply three coats with this. That doesn't surprise me with this white. Now, this one is a little bit more streaky than the regular white nail polishes they have, which are pretty good in my opinion. Um, but this is uh, applies a little bit differently, and it probably has to do with the fact that it glows in a black light. They put that chemical in it. I did wear this on my nails. You'll see pictures and video inserted of the black light stuff. And it chipped in three days. And I did apply a top coat over top of it. And I thought it would be fun to stamp this one as well. Just so we could see what it does. Overall, out of all the shades that I did pick up, I really loved this one the most. So energy. And in the black light, it does glow a bright blue hue which I absolutely love. I expect nothing less from a white and it looks fantastic in the black light and in the pictures. It looks awesome.
Energy dries down not flat matte, but not glossy either. Um, so keep that in mind. So, you know, top coat that. Um, next up, we have Luminous. And this is also a sheer thin formula. It is a neon fluorescent nail polish. It, that's to be expected. This one is like a bright peachy slash coral. And then when it dries on your nails, it's more like a fluorescent orange. And it's opaque in three coats unless you apply this over a white nail polish. And this also takes only a few minutes to dry. And this polish also chipped in three days. I did top coat it because it dries flat. So add a top coat for shine for this one. Um, it definitely has that matte dry down because it's like a fluorescent neon shade does it glow it absolutely glows just this one glows a bright pink kind of hue and very fluorescent yeah that's my review i hope you found it helpful enjoyed it stay tuned for more. thank you so much for watching don't forget to check the description box for additional links don't forget to like the video comment subscribe and ring the bell if you haven't already thank you so very much for watching